Good evening. Tonight, CCTV footage, which according to a lawyer, shows police carrying out an unprovoked attack on a man in a jeweler's shop. He'd gone in with a friend to buy a Valentine's present for his partner. The police asked them for identification and said they'd had reports of two men acting suspiciously. Then, suddenly, the officer put one of the men in a headlock. His solicitor says it was an unprovoked attack. Mark Goff reports. Look at the top right-hand screen. Dean Davis, in the white baseball cap, is looking for a Valentine's present for his partner. He's with his friend. Two police officers come in. In the next few minutes, according to Mr Davis and his solicitor, the officers say they've had reports of two men acting suspiciously and ask for their identification. Mr Davis claims he asked police what they suspected him of. The officer points at Mr Davis. And then this happened. There's a struggle, and Mr Davis claims that the officer, without provocation, puts him in a headlock. The incident happened here, in Birmingham's jewellery quarter. Mr Davis has lodged a complaint about the officer with West Midlands Police. Basically, he said that he had a report of two people acting suspicious in the jewellery quarter, but he didn't tell me exactly what I was supposed to be suspicious of. Got to be at least four or five officers, and while he had me in a headlock, I could just feel other officers gripping me by my arms, my legs, and pushing me down on the counter in the jewellery shop. And it, were you a regular in the shop anyway? Well, I wasn't a stranger. I've been there on a good few occasions, so I know it wasn't them that called the police, and he vouched for me at the time, telling the police that he knew me. Mr Davis's solicitor believes what happened was unlawful. We suggest that, firstly, the uh, attempt to detain Mr Davis is entirely unlawful, that he has been assaulted, and the fact that he's then taken out of the shop in handcuffs, held in a van, uh, searched, uh, generally humiliated, uh, amounts to an unlawful detention. There is CCTV that is readily available that shows an officer after an exchange which clearly does not show Mr uh, Davis behaving any way aggressively or in any diff way difficult, and the officer grabs hold of him, others pile in, and Mr Davis is clearly being assaulted. This happened in February. West Midlands Police is examining the complaint. Mr Davis's solicitor, who believes the officer should be investigated for assault, says a charge for common assault must be brought within six months. The deadline for that passed yesterday. We've spoken to West Midlands Police and they say this matter is being looked into by their professional standards team and they expect a result from that team in the next three to four weeks. Mark Goff, ITV News. Birmingham. A father accused.